Hello and welcome to my unboxing and first look at the Warhammer Plus Year 3 free miniature. Uh, you've got a choice between two and I picked uh, Carlina uh, von Karstein, Karstein uh, for Soulblight Gravelords uh, for Warhammer Age of Sigma. It is free as part of your 40 or 50 pound um, subscription. Uh, you could either pick her or you could pick the unbroken Carskin Sergeant uh, for Astra Militarum uh, for Warhammer 40,000. Um, you still get the option of getting that miniature, uh, you just have to pay for it. Um, so yeah, it's a Warhammer Plus kind of paywall in a way. I mean, you're getting a £25 miniature and then you'd uh, buy the other one for £25, only available from uh, Games Workshop's web store. But anyway, uh, this miniature comprises of nine plastic components and comes with a 40 millimeter round base. Anyway, here is uh, the box, which um, Carlina is. It's a very kind of wet, soggy box. It's been raining here uh, for the past few days and it's due to rain even more. Um, it's October. I don't even know if my knife will get through this soggy box. Very soggy. Yes, here is the miniature. Carlina von Karstein, Karstein. I'm going to say Karstein. Um, you only get one. I don't think you can buy another one. Um, you can buy the the other, uh, you know, miniature that you wouldn't get for free. Uh, but yeah, looks quite nice. Uh, alternate head. You can uh, give her a helmet that matches her um, hair, <laughs> apparently. Um, or you can just have her without the helmet. Um, it looks like it's the same sword and cup, though. Or chalice, whatever you want to call it. So, yeah, in here. Uh, yeah, unfortunately, we've got a plastic uh, insert. But there's the sprue, there's the base, that will go in the recycle. Um, and let's have a look in the instruction guide first of all for these components. So, um, these are all the parts. Uh, the nine parts. Uh, a little bit of a scenic base, I guess, there. Um, you get the two different head options, and that's it. Quite easy, straightforward to put together. Um, and then I guess that's the rules. I'm going to have a hunt for the actual rules um, somewhere. Um, but uh, I think Carlina von Karstein can be used as a vampire lord. Uh, so um, I don't think she'll have her own like unique name character rules, which is a bit of a shame, but you know, uh, at least you can use her as a vampire lord. This is the uh, spirit itself. Um, Hopefully you can see that. The lighting's a bit odd today with all the rain. There we go. We got the focus in. So there's the uh, kind of back and the uh, the dress. There's the um, scenic base, and I think that's the shoulder pauldron. And then there's a long leg there, and a nice sword. And there's her head. I don't know if you can see that uh, with the helmet. I think I might go for the helmet version. And then you've got the head without the helmet as well. And then the chalice. And then, you know, the, the front armor. Yeah, quite straightforward to put together. I'll build that in a few minutes. Um, I'll obviously give you a review uh, once she is constructed. Uh, what do you think of uh, Carlina? Von Karstein, um, and actually what do you think of the Unbroken miniature uh, while we're at it? Um, I might pick up the um, Unbroken miniature, it depends as always, uh, but please do put your thoughts and opinions down in the comments uh, for this miniature down below. Thank you for joining me today, thank you for watching, Blood for the Blood God.